Hello my darlings, I hope you're doing very well. In today's video, I look very pale. I don't know what's going on here, bad lighting, I'm not sure. Um, but in today's video, I am getting tattooed. This is a vlog. I haven't done a proper tattoo vlog in years at this point. <laughs> um, just because I prefer to make content where I'm just like sitting down, talking to you as if I was talking to a friend. Because uh, I feel like a lot of people do like vlogging with tattoos and I guess it would make more sense if I vlogged getting my tattoos just because... You know, that's the content I make. I don't know. If you didn't see, I recently uploaded a video where I designed my next tattoo, which is one of the tattoos I will be getting today, which is the word darling on my hand right here. I talk about it in depth and why I'm getting it and all of that jazz in that video. I'm getting this tattoo done by Meg, who works at Hand of Mysteries, which is where my boyfriend Tom's sister works. So she kind of arranged all of this for me which is hella cool i'm also getting another tattoo today i'm getting two tattoos today from two different artists but in the same studio that one will be by ella she's basically just doing a love heart for me and inside of the love heart it just says dogs <laughs> just because i love dogs so much and i feel like it's about time i got some kind of dog related tattoo even though i don't have a dog i will get a dog eventually but the house that me and Tom rent, um, the landlord, who is very nice by the way, he is a great landlord, um, but he doesn't allow pets or anything. And also our garden isn't really a garden, it's basically just, you know, a patio area, some gravel and all of that. So the time at the moment is 11.04. I just went to order some food because I'm leaving in like 45 minutes. Uh, I went to order some Greg's, which for those that don't know, Greg's is like a place where you get like baked goods, bakery stuff, like pasties, sausage rolls, all of that. But they're not delivered until after half 11. So I was like, well, that's not going to help because I've got to leave. You know, I cannot wait for it to be delivered and then eat within like 15 minutes or whatever. So I had to order a KFC. <laughs> <laughs> like the only other option I had really was Subway and I was not feeling I've gone completely off Subway I haven't had it in probably like over a year at this point I don't know what it is I'm just not in the mood for Subway so I have my backpack here I'm actually going to be out all day <laughs> I'm going to get tattooed and I'll be at the studio from like my first appointment's at 2 and then I think the next one's at 4 so I'm going to be there until it sort of closes. Then me and Tom's sister are going to like a pub quiz with her mum and their auntie. And I don't know if Tom's coming or not at the moment. But basically I'm going to be out until like 10 o'clock this evening I think. So I've got like a backpack full of stuff. Well not full of stuff to be honest. I've just got like headphones. I'm bringing a new uh, tattoo aftercare that I'm using. That I've seen a few of you guys mention. Where is it? There is. <laughs> um, but I ordered this, um, it's only a tiny little pot, but I ordered this because a few of you guys had mentioned it in like a Facebook group and then in comments on my videos and it's Yayo Tattoo Butter. Before I started using this, I was using Butterlux, which I still love, but this is really good. I really, really like it. I've been using it for my uh, finger touch-ups. I don't know, again, if you watched my video about me designing my next tattoo, you'll know that I got my finger tattoos touched up the Eleanor and then the uh, sword dagger just because they were struggling a little bit and I also got another tattoo which is really crispy at the minute because it's a week old I got a yippee ki -yay. just a small little yippee ki -yay. a yay yippee ki motherfucker in that little gap there just because Die Hard is one of my favorite films oh god I love it so so much but yeah I've been using this uh yeah, yo. I wanted to try it out and what have you because I like to try new things, you know. I got two of them. I got a Bubblicious one which pretty much smells exactly like my Butterlux Bubblegum Tattoo Aftercare. And But this one is Autumn. And I don't understand the Autumn. <laughs> but it does smell nice. It doesn't have, you know like when you smell an autumnal candle and it's like apple cinnamony. I'm not getting that from this. But it is a nice scent. I just wouldn't say it's Autumn. It's quite a solid like tattoo aftercare so for me uh what's it called the one that i don't like the smell of anymore hustle butter hustle butter is quite a weird texture it's quite i don't know rough and then but it's quite smooth and then for me butterlux is very smooth that is 
like butter to me this is quite hard but then once it starts to melt in your fingers it's like very hard coconut oil if that makes sense it's really good i've been enjoying it a lot um i like how you don't really need much of it you know just a little like circle and then it's like boop 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 and then you're done it's quite oily i got this um package from one of my favorite uh jewelry i'm not wearing my rings but then i am getting my hand tattooed later so i probably shouldn't be wearing rings so we'll leave it um <laughs> but yeah one of my favorite jewelry brands has sent me i don't know how to get into this hello um but yeah one of my favorite brands uh, etta love have sent me um some earrings and they gave me a discount code for you guys as well which is really cool so i'm just gonna pop it down there but I have a few pieces from Etta Love now. The jewellery is, to my aesthetic, like, gothic-y. But they do have, like, cute stuff as well, if that makes sense. But I love their, like, skulls, daggers, and all of that thing. Because that's just, yeah, who I am as a person. So they've sent me a ring sizer, which is freaking cool. Love that. You can never have, um... Oh, what's the word? Enough of those. <laughs> I've got one upstairs, but I will always take another one. Oh, is this, like, a little badge? Oh, my God, that's so cute! Oh my god, I love that. Oh, is, I think my food's on the way. Is my food on the way? Yes, love that for me. Here is the earring. They reached out and was like, oh, can we send you another item? And I was like, hell yeah. And I got to choose. Oh, oh my god, these are gorgeous. So these are sterling silver as well, so they're not going to tarnish. Oh, that goes out of that earring. Okay, I'm going to put these in and I think my food will be here in literally like two seconds. I don't know. But I'll be back. Okay, so my food is here. I am gonna quickly scran that. Put the earrings in. They're so freaking cute. I love them so much. Okay, so I need to eat this. My I'm getting a taxi to the train station. That'll be here in like 20-ish minutes, maybe a little bit less than that. I don't know. Um, so I'm gonna eat and then it'll be time to go. Mm. Oh boy, that is the quickest I've ever eaten in my whole entire life. <laughs> but I am now fully fueled but probably not the most healthiest food, but I'm fueled for the tattoo sessions I'm about to have. Super important to make sure that you eat something before a tattoo session to keep yourself going because there is literally nothing worse than being hungry while getting tattooed and it could really affect your blood sugar levels, which means you can get a little bit cranky, which means you might not be able to handle the pain as much. I am now waiting for my taxi man so i can go to the train station i haven't even bought my train ticket yet that's so rude of me <laughs> i better do that now Ugh, train tickets are so freaking expensive like this train journey i'm about to do takes about half an hour maybe a little bit more than that it's like 25 quid my return flight from amsterdam when i went to amsterdam with my um best friend yasmin that was 11 pound what gives <laughs> i've had flights cheaper than the trains i get you know on like a weekly basis at this point i'm just at the train station and i'm just standing by some pansies my mum loved pansies just a little fyi there i don't know <laughs> but pansies remind me of my childhood which is weird i know okay but yeah i'll be waiting here for a while because i'm super early Okay, so a little update for you guys. I'm just sitting here minding my own business. Um, unfortunately, Meg has had to cancel on me. She wasn't feeling well. I just got a text from Tom's sister who works at the studio. Um, so I have an hour or so to kill. Well, like two hours. So I'm just going to go and do some shopping. Like these things happen. So there's always another day to get my uh, darling hand tattoos. <laughs> You're coming home with me. That's disgusting. Mm -hmm. ASMR. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry, it's best to get one. Yeah, I think that fits really nice. Well, <laughs> 
This is Midge. Midge has a problem. <laughs> She's got one, two, three, four, five drinks. Do not. That's not Gary. Are you really going to drink all though? Yeah. Watch me. <laughs> Watch me. Yeah, watch her sit in the toilet for the next four hours. <laughs> A disgrace. <laughs> That's enough Gary time for this video. Edit him out. <laughs> Blur his face. Just, yeah. Every time we say Gary, just like beep it. With a fart noise. Yeah, so no one knows that it's him. That's not. Good tips though, because she's beautiful. Look at her. Love you. Oh, it's so cute! Drink three. Midge finished. has finished drink three. <laughs> we have this one left and then that one there left. My tattoo's done, by the way. I'm just hanging out now, being a little studio gremlin. It's absolutely chucking down with rain. Love that for me. <laughs> 